Hi, this is Brian Wilson with uh, BFW Classroom, and today we're going to talk about shaping curved word art layers. One thing you'll notice different with today's video is that all of the pieces were actually recorded on my Android phone using the Adobe Express app, not just the desktop app, so you can see it still functions in both settings. We're going back to that same three-layer piece that I did before, and you can see that there are two different word boxes. Now, the top one says Voyager. To create that quarter curve, what I had to do was create spacing in the word. Now, I will say when you use this template, the words that you swap out should be the same length or at least the same size. So with Cassini being shorter than Voyager, it doesn't have the same kind of arc to it. So I have to modify the different spaces on the beginning and the end of the word. I didn't like how close it was to the NASA block, so I put in an extra space at the beginning and then I added some afterwards. Down at the bottom, where it says launched, I had to change that too because the launch dates for Voyager were different from Cassini. And I need to make sure that I wanted the same kind of spacing so that way you can see the picture behind it. Because the one I'm using in this one is slightly different from the Voyager piece that I used. So when you use the numbers and switch them around, just be mindful. Play with a little bit. Make sure your spacing looks correctly. On this one, you can see where I did a couple of different things where I added stuff at the beginning and the end on the Gale Crater part, so that way it's, it looked correct on the spacing. What you'll notice in both of these is that I have two word blocks at the top and the bottom, and they might be different sizes, but they are centered with each other on that layer that is the word layer. Hey, don't forget to hit the subscribe button there on the right, or click on the video above to see one of the other tutorials I've made. Again, this is Brian Wilson. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed.